take this across the 25. A couple extra yards on the 27 yard line. So here are the Giants ready to start their initial drive of the game. And leading them out there, we get a look at their 6 3 quarterback. And I like what his head coach told us about him this week. That no matter what happens, he, whether he throws seven interceptions or seven touchdown passes, he's the same assertive leader in the huddle on each and every play. He can throw the seven interceptions, just blame the football, blame anything else, and still carry himself like he is the man. It's like you, assertive in our production meetings. Well, especially when we're talking about ordering dinner. I was just going to say. That's, that's where I go. Couple for him there in the game's first play you and second down. And the starting offense now for the Giants. So let's all work together on this one because it's natural to just watch the football. But I want all of us to watch the center of this offensive line, the center and the two guards. They've got to be able to control the point of attack, and they didn't do such a good job on that last play. Plenty of opportunities to redeem themselves. They'll have to take advantage of that and start to make progress. terrific unit. They play together very, very well, and they don't permit big plays to happen. Play here, this opening drive is up against a third and five. From the gun, Fields. Oh, he's got a man wide open, complete. And he'll be taken down again before they work it across midfield. A well executed 22-yard game. He's such a good runner. Shows it there on third down. Very proficient and a good pass. And you know what I've observed over the years in the NFL? The better a route runner you are, the more confidence your guy's going to have in you to go to you in important times because he can trust you being in the right spot. And they connected there and picked up a first down. So into Packer territory now. Here's first and 10 at the 46. They'll run it now out of the gun. It's a pickup of four, and it'll bring up second down. Well, I think that's what they're going to need to do here in the first half. You've got to take some pressure off this young quarterback, and no better way to do it than to establish the running game early. Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. Let's go, Let's go! Off the bootleg, Fields. And he's going to keep it here. And he'll go down here at the 35-yard line. Maybe not exactly what they had in mind, but that scramble good for six and a first down. And he got a pretty good gain out of it. Ball up to the 35 now as they come up on first and 10. They run the counter. Dobbins. And he is met quickly in the backfield. And down he goes, folded like a lawn chair. It'll be a loss of a yard. And that'll bring up a second and 11. Came out in a power set. That only served a couple more men in the box. And guess what? If you're going to do that, you got to win up front, right? Your offensive guys have got to beat the defenders. They lost all leverage on that play. Take the field. 
Let's go. 15, Lonnie. 15, Lonnie. Watch tight. Tight ends right. Watch tight. Tight ends right. And ready. Draw play for Brown. And he'll just plow right into a host of tacklers. Nothing there at all, and it'll be second and ten. A quick observation, Brandon, because early on in this game, I'm seeing linebackers putting their noses close to the line of scrimmage. And my guess is the wheels are turning on that other sideline. As a play caller, you're filing that away right now, aren't you? Yeah, you're trying to find that opportunity later on when you can play action them or stick something to them between the second and the third level. Now he'll look to play here on second and ten. a small glimpse there as to why they like this rookie so much. And that's why they lit up a little bit in our meetings with the coaching staff. Didn't yeah, when we talked about it, they did. Yeah, yeah, you know, they like his work ethic. You know, this guy's running every route well wait, in the wait, route tree look. and getting better at it all the time. Really honing his game. They expect a pretty good jump out of him as things continue to move on. They'll run on first down. It's Brown. Two yards on the pick up there. It'll be second and eight. Well, we saw him there trying to get it to the outside, trying to get to the perimeter, but not a whole lot of room there. But there's got to be one positive to that. If you keep moving laterally, creases tend to develop as the game moves on, and they can run it back inside later. He's good. He's good. On second down, it's Brown. And the reinforcements come in as they're going to stop him behind the line. This will be a loss of three, and now a much tougher third down looming. He was able to escape momentarily in the backfield, but you could just kind of tell that wasn't going anywhere. You know, in the film session, he'll get a minus for not getting him on the ground by himself. But what the coach is really going to analyze, how fast did his teammates get there to help him? If one guy slows him up, everyone else better be there. And that's what they got on that play. 50 play. I got one, I got one, I got one. Single, single. Play. On third down, Clifford. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. visiting team to come in and set the tone on defense. In fact, when we talked with them prior to the game, they said they wanted this home crowd to feel like they had to hide their valuables when they were in town. <laughs> well, the home on now is the Packers punter as he's on here to punt it away. <laughs> and he didn't quite have the back spin on that one. He gets it to four and continues into the end zone. It's a touchback. And New York set to take the field. And they were intercepted the first time they had the football. On first down, Dobbins. And he'll go down at the 26, following a gain of six. A pretty burst there and a nice little bit off. A pretty decent game. Brings up second and four at the 26 yard line. From the 26, they'll line up on second and four. And he probably should have given that one off as he's going to get hit and taken down behind the line. We're scoreless after one. Giant football, and we're ready to begin the second quarter. They've got a third down and five to start things out. Let's just go to the football 101, the trite expression 101. Win first down. 
make five, six, seven yards on first down and make it a second and three, second and manageable. Keep accumulating first downs that way. Keep moving the football. You don't want to get behind the sticks because then the defense has the advantage. We got three. We got three, fellas. We got three. They'll run on first down. Brown. And just no champ down the line of scrimmage. How about the way he just Six flowed guys. and got to the outside part of the field made that play? On second down now, it's Brown. Fights forward for only about a yard after the 21. Because otherwise, this defense is going to gang up on the run and set them down. The threat of a second straight to start the game is looming as they come up third and ten. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Defensive backs, they covered well, allowed for the sacks. So does were a nickel when you were a kid? No, I just needed the extra nickel oh. so, I could pay the, so I could pay the proper okay, price. Okay, how much were they, a dime? <laughs> were they? Uh, 15 cents. Packers punter as the drive goes backwards, so he's on to punt it away. turn up field he just couldn't no they really had a picket fence in front of him no room to find to get up field you ain't got nothing. You ain't got nothing. <laughs> to throw on third down fields firing quickly here and that's complete and he will be very close to a first down but i see the close fist to the referee and that means fourth down so many ways to the intro is actually one of the safer things an offense can do Get the ball out to the receiver as fast as possible. Hope he's got man-to-man -man coverage and hope that his athleticism wins on the perimeter. Send out their punter now as he'll punt it away for the second time. And no return possible here as they angle this one out of bounds. Let's go! And Green Bay getting ready to go as they take the field. They've had it twice. They've punted twice. Not the start they were hoping for. Not at all. And let's face it, every facility we visit, everyone talks about converting on third down, how big that is. In this situation, they've had to punt it away twice. So they're furiously going over things on the sidelines. What do we need to do to pick up a first down and change our momentum? Down. Ten logo. On first down, Brown. And not a whole lot to speak of there as they'll bring him down shy of the 20. Just a yard on the pickup there, and he'll bring up a second and nine. They tried a quick hitter inside, but that one was swallowed up because what they're hoping, this big defensive lineman will take the bait and move laterally and open up a crease that they can run through. Didn't happen on that play. To throw on second down. Clifford, and his throw is going to be incomplete. Complete pass on second down. That'll leave him trying to convert on third and nine. From the game, Clifford. And that will be incomplete. Now, they weren't scared to let it fly, but it falls to the ground and brings up fourth down. This team is... On now is the Packers punter. As he'll come on to kick this one away. He's been a busy man here in this first half as he gets it away. A big kick there. We'll call it 56 yards on the block. And possession will switch hands first and 10. 
But New York set to take the field. And still no points on the scoreboard. You're coming off of the three and out. They're just looking for anything to grab onto right now, aren't they? I'm wondering if someone's going to take charge in the huddle. You know, we always look and look to the quarterback, but sometimes it's another player on the team, a star, a veteran, someone with some excitement and energy. It's like, all right, guys, let's shake things up and let's go because they still have an opportunity to make things happen. Yeah, shake it up. So they'll come up first and 10 now from the 33. <laughs> Operating from the gun, Fields. And it's a short one here, complete to his tight end. Give him a couple on the catch in second and eight. And Barton, I think that's a great example that not all tight ends are created equal. Because everything was right. He got the completion, but he's not one of the more dynamic guys in the league. So even though he caught it, couldn't turn it into much more. So second and eight here after the pass play for two yards on first down. Here's second and eight. Six yards there off the scramble, but it'll still leave him with a third down. Partner, he was going through his progressions. Not there, not there. After about the third one, he decided he better pull it down and run for it. And he slides down and avoids the hit for good measure. They'll get to the line here, but remember, it's also third down. From the gun, Fields. He's got his man on the crossing run. And he gets this one to midfield before he's brought down. And they do it for these situations, first down. And they build that trust, and that's why they're able to find him in this type of a situation. First no. down now, but the clock continues to move. Back to throw, Fields. Going left side, it's complete. Well, he is out of bounds, but not before he's inside the 30. A good pick up there, a 22. First down, offense finding its legs now. Here's another first and ten. Operating from the gun. Fields. He's going to hit his man out of the backfield. Complete. The Giants going to go ahead and use the first of their timeouts as they get the stoppage with a little over 50 seconds to go in the first half. That first down completion only netted him three. Second and seven. Looking to throw. Fields. Throw's gonna be incomplete, but only the second quarter. A lot of time to change things. They head to the line facing a third and seven following the incompletion on second down. And he's caught right at the 10-yard line. Now the Giants will use the second of their three timeouts as they'll stop it with just over 40 seconds to go in the first half. First trip to the red zone for the Giants. They're looking at a first and goal from about the nine. Fields. And that will be knocked a shot from the nine on second and goal. Second and nine now. And he's got it. Touchdown, Giants. A nine-yard touchdown grab. As his guys are on the board first here tonight. And that touchdown gives them a touchdown lead before they attempt the extra point. What a great way to end the half. Yeah, great job to put themselves in front. And now, see on the sideline, special teams defense scrambling, saying we want to preserve this for the final moments of this second quarter. So a challenge coming down from the booth, and that's where these challenges come from, of course, in the final two minutes of the half. The previous yeah, play is under New review, York. right? That's command central for the officials. They'll talk, they'll take a look at it, communicate with the referee at the game site, and issue a final decision because they do have the final call now. After they give them the play, an extra look, but they found the it stands. is a touchdown indeed. The official says this one counts. The now the extra point the try forthcoming. Play. It's up, it's good, and the Giants have a 7 nothing lead. Team on the 
the field now as they will send this one away. This is taken at the three. They're going to take it up past the 25 to the 26 yard line. The Green Bay offense now about ready to take possession here. So far, they've had three drives, three punts. Not good. Not good indeed because you've got to have something to show for being out on the field. Now, sometimes if you have a game where neither side has scored, three punts isn't a bad thing. But when you're trying to set the pace, get up on top in a game, you've got to show better offense and find a way to put some points on the board. Just over 30 seconds 18, to go in the half. They've got Strong it first and 10. Strong Ready, ready. Well, indeed, start on the ground to run that clock. And defensively, they're just looking to keep him contained as they're able to get him down. The Packers going to use one of their timeouts. As the clock will stop with just under 30 seconds to go in the first half. Second and two. Throwing for his running back, but he's got him complete. And the Packers going to go ahead and use the second of their timeouts. As the stoppage will come with 23 seconds to go till halftime. Packers going to burn their third and final timeout as a stopper with 17 seconds to go in this first half of action. Second and 12 after the first down pass play went backwards for two yards. Here we go on second and 12. Wide open receiver complete. And they're going to have another first down as the tackle's made at the Giants' 31 yard line. So even though it's first down, here's the field goal unit on now to try to get three before halftime. On the left hash, this from 48 yards. And he missed it. He missed it just wide of that left upright. It's no good. So we've reached halftime with just the lone touchdown here. 7-0 is our score. As we'll send you down to Orlando, we check in with Jonathan Coachman for our EA Sports Halftime Report. Okay, Coach, appreciate it. A one-touchdown game here as we get set to resume play in the second half. Both teams appear ready for the fight ahead, and we resume action here in quarter number three. This is fielded at the goal line. And he's up across the 25 and down at the 28-yard line. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! And Green Bay getting ready to go as they take the field. They're close, close game, but they're going to need to do a little bit better probably here in half two, no? I would agree with that totally. I would guess it in the locker room. They talked about cleaning up some of the errors. But overall, I think they wanted to be positive with them. Guys, we're right there. Just not playing as well as we need to. Let's pick it up. And we still have a chance to win this game. Yeah, they do. We'll see if they can pick it I'm up. ready. Let's go one more. On first down, Clifford. second and long situation. It seemed pretty dire, but they brought it back to third Let's manageable go. with that 70, run. 70, Indy. Watch tight end, watch tight end. Tight right, tight two. On third down, Check. Clifford. Check. Oh, he's got a wide open, complete. And another first down as the tackle's made at the Giants' 32 yard round. I don't know what they talked about at halftime, but it was, it worked. They look like a different team here in the third quarter. Yeah, I doubt that they're very many trash
territory now, first and 10 at the 32-yard line. They'll run on first down. It's Brown. Try to find a lane, but instead he'll get back to the line of scrimmage. Get the outlaw. Play fake. Clifford. And his throw is incomplete. Contemplating their moves before single, actually single. making one, I and none of them being done very yeah. confident. Truth be told, I never yeah. play chess, yeah. and I know that I'm not smart enough to play chess. Guys like you. And he's going to go down. They get to him back at the 40. Well, they went with a nickel. They throw in an extra defensive back. The coverage was very good. Yeah, it was exactly as you would expect, a passing down. You bring in the nickel package, just as you described, the coverage was excellent and allowed one of their linemen to end up getting to the quarterback. It's the Packers punter. He's been terrific so far. No returning this one. It sails out of bounds. And this one the trail. The Giants offense now getting set to start the third quarter. They have the lead here. Well, we talk a lot about pregame speeches. What are halftime speeches like? For the most part, not nearly as emotional. They're a lot more clinical. Every now and then, though, they'll get after you if they think they need to light a fire. But in this case, let's go into the virtual locker room because here's what I think happened. They got in there and they said, listen, Let's take control right away. We defense. We got the deep. We got the, we got the lead. Defense. defense. Don't give up any defense. points. Turn the ball back over to the offense and let them go down and score and give us more of a cushion in the game. Check so far. But a moot point there as they were able to connect. I'm going back to you. From the 32 now. Back to you. Here's first and 10. Fighting him off. And he'll be tackled just past the 35 at the 36. Give him four yards there on the first down keeper. Silver, On second down, Dobbins. And it's been like this all night long. Nowhere to run as they stop him behind the line. It's a loss of two, now third down. The Packers bringing in an extra member of the secondary here to try for the third down stop. From the gun, Fields. Wide open receiver complete. And this is going to result in another first down as the tackle's made at the Packers' 44-yard line. And they were able to successfully complete that one. So into Packer territory now. Here's first and 10 at the 44-yard line. Operating from the gun, Fields. Looking left sideline, it's complete. He'll get 15 and a Giants first down. And a good quarterback facing zone coverage. If he has just a little bit of time to survey the scene, that's what's going to happen. No doubt about it. If there's no pressure, he's going to continue to pick them apart because he'll have all that time to find someone open downfield. He can only cover for so long. So maybe they want to go to a zone blitz scheme, get a little bit more pressure. Remember when Carolina did that against Denver? They lost the game ultimately. They dropped the defensive end out, and he ended up with an interception in that game in Super Bowl 50. Maybe some sort of scheme like that to try and get more pressure at the passer. Off play action. Fields. Quick hitter here. It's complete. Yeah, he's going to get a solid gain of nine before being brought down. Second and right in the yard. Thinks him with a very manageable second and one. Second and one. And a quick throw here. That's complete. And on this one, he'll get to the 15, right at the 15-yard line. This quarterback now, 14 out of 17, 82%, and it's first and 10. It's out, it's loose, and the Packers pick it up. He's at the 50, the 30, 20.
Fielded about a yard deep. They're going to bring it back to just about the 25. Caught up the 24 yard line. You're ready. You're ready. Good for a giant first down. First and ten at the 34 yard line. From the 34 now, here's first and ten. Go! From the gun, Fields. And he's got it. Got his man on the end route. Complete. A good pick up there. Eight yards on the first down completion. Back now in Pittsburgh. All even as we get ready to start the fourth. the kick 
kickoff unit as they run up and send this one away. This fielded at the two. And a good return is going to stop just shy of the 30 yard line. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. The Green Bay offense now about ready to take possession here. These guys had to punt last time. It has not been a very fruitful game offensively thus far. They haven't even made a trip to the red zone. And I know that everyone's going crazy on that sideline because that drives you berserk to come off the field, not really move the ball well. As you said, not even get to the red zone, let alone, you know, not even put points on the board. They've got to just take a deep breath, relax, try and figure out what is working, and call Ready? more of that. They've got tight left. Watch out in. Watch out in. Kim. Kim is tight. Ready? On first and ten. Clifford. Throwing no, and it's complete. And oh, they get him down, but now the four takes it across the 40 yard line. What he did. Picked up first down, too. Man left, man left. Hey, hey, hey. You got three. You got three. Right up. Snap. Throwing on first down. Clifford. And you'll find this man on the outside. Take this to the other side of midfield before going out of bounds. 11 yards and a Green Bay Packer first down. Working the sideline there. Good route, good catch. First down, and he gets out of bounds. Yeah, you have to like the play call because you have to bring some guys down the middle of the field to draw some of the defenders away. They can't just let them go off the sideline exclusively. That's how it's going to work. Sidelines and incompletions to use the play. Now this one complete downfield on the left side. And he gets this inside the 35-yard line. Give him 15 there, and the Packers have a first. Ready? This quarterback now six for six since coming One, four, back two, out of the locker four, room. Two. It's single, first single, and ten. Single, single. He's good. He's good. Operating from the gun. Clifford firing quickly here, and that's complete. And he'll be brought down somewhat awkwardly here, and a lost flag is well. Defense. I think this one's going to be a face mask. Bro, when you're leading in the fourth quarter, that's not Come the on, penalty bro. you want. Not Come at all. Now your discipline comes into question. Having poise this stage of the game, you can't have those kind of plays. Penalty moves him into the red zone here on first and ten. A run here with Brown. And he stopped after only a yard, taking it down to the 14. Well, that call makes sense because they've been throwing it well on this drive. And once again, they show passing formation, showing shotgun. Then they ran out of it. That's a nice play by them defensively, though, to hold it to a short gain. Here's second and nine, just a yard on that last run. Two times, two times. Three down, three down. Right Off the play play. Clifford. Wide open receiver from Payne. And it stopped a few yards shy of the goal line at the 40. A good looking drive for the Packers so far. It's a first down. So much goes into a successful play, doesn't it? How about that play action there? Freezing the defense just enough Get to, the ball. to swing the Get tight to end the ball. free downfield for the completion. Five. Well, look to throw. Three out, three out. Looking end zone, but it's incomplete. In this situation, he'll need to. They'll go again from the three here on second and goal. Two. Back to throw. To the goal line, but it's incomplete. Yeah. Is on the same page. This is third and goal. And this Giants defense, they have withstood the test thus far. He's back to throw. And he can't get a throw away. He's taken down. The amount of sacks that they've absorbed in this game is absolutely extraordinary. Let's just face it. This offensive line, flat out, cannot handle this pass rush. It's been demonstrated time and time again. Biggest kicks of the night is forthcoming. From the left hash, a chip shot here. And his kick is right there. It's
the kicks away. This is taken at his four. And he'll take this one near the 25, call it the 26 yard line. Let's go! Let's go! The New York set to take the field. They've got work to do, but they do still have a bit of time here. And they've got to feel comfortable with that. But they have all their play sequences called. If they get out of bounds, that allows them to huddle and call another play. But if they don't, it's hurry up to the line of scrimmage and either spike it and stop the clock or continue to move it downfield in order to try and get in range and win this game. See if they can do just that. a tough situation for him as I see it but the truth of the matter is that ball was not streaking towards him that little arc on it he's got to find a way to get his head around and make the play in football Roll it. Five, 36. <laughs> on first and we ten Phoenix they roll him up but he can't get a throw he's taken down what a huge play at this point in the game the Giants going to go ahead and use the first of their timeouts as he'll stop him with a little over 30 ticks to go in the football game. The sack cost him only a yard. It's second and 11. Second and 11. And he can't get a throw away. He's taken down. And the Giants will use the second of their three timeouts. As he'll stop him with 25 ticks remaining on the clock. To throw on third down. Fields. Sliding out of the pocket. He may try and run for this. Now he's going to get this all the way down inside the 35. And this is going to result in another first down as the tackle's made at the Packers' 34-yard line. After the sack, you can understand it maybe being a little bit nervous back there, a little skittish. He looked awfully decisive when he took off and ran. Very decisive and picked up that first down in the process. From the 34 now, here's first and 10. Here we go, D. Now, what a man, here we go. Check, check. And it's been like this all night long. Another one to run as they stop him behind the line. And the clock will now stop as a timeout is called with five seconds left. And now it all rests on the right foot of their kicker. And the clock will now stop as a timeout is called with five seconds left. This game's going to come down to the right leg of their kicker. And the clock will now stop as a timeout is called with five seconds left. And now it all rests on the right foot of their kicker. This a long one from 54. And the clock will now stop as a timeout is called with five seconds left. And now this game's going to come down to the right. Tyler Durbin is super reliable inside of 40. This is from 45, and it's blocked. Lions scoop it up. Brad Haley will score! Oh, 